This is where the magic happens. We are live inside the SpaceX facility, taking a look at future of space travel. We need to verify the alignment on section three. The tolerances look good on the tablet, but let's double check the physical connection. I'll prep the torque wrench. Hold the scan right there. See that deviation? Yes, logging the coordinates now. It's within tolerance, but marginal. The thermal readings are stable across the segment. Confirmed. The structural integrity schematic is clear. Good to proceed. And here we go. The press engages, shaping the alloy in seconds. The steam is a byproduct. The automated systems are hard at work. The X of X arm is handling the primary structure, while the smaller arms manage the precise welding you see here. Ensuring the integrity of these welds is paramount. This scan confirms the halves are perfectly aligned and ready for the next stage. Laser alignment is locked at 0.7. Copy that. Ready for integration. Readings are stable. Proceed. We're looking at the propulsion system for the Starship here. The team is calibrating the turbo pumps, and that torque sequence means we are one step closer to launch. We are now lowering the main propellant tank. The alignment must be perfect, accurate to the millimeter, ensuring structural integrity for launch. Bring her down slowly, watch the alignment pins. Clear on this side, stable descent. Roger that, coming into position now. The readouts confirm optimal pressure stabilization. Now that the torque sequence is complete, this tank is cleared for integration into the Starship structure. Okay, ease now, bring it down five centimeters. Copy that, watching the pressure, looks good on my side. This is where the forward section of the Starship comes together. 
We're using specialized tooling here to ensure the integrity of the tank. Torque looks good on this side. Same here. Crane is active, everyone clear the bay. As the engine is lowered, we're monitoring the alignment closely on the screen. Looks aligned. Proceeding with the final seating now. As you can see, the team is finalizing the turbo pump assembly. This engine is designed for full reusability, a key step in reaching Mars. Please. The alignment on Gimbal 7 looks slightly off the baseline. It's within tolerance, but let's monitor the pressure sensors during the lock sequence. This specialized friction stir weld ensures a perfect seal on the main combustion chamber, absolutely vital for the pressures involved. This is where the magic happens. The nose cone assembly requires incredible precision. Hold position, we're clear on the alignment pins. Copy that. Engaging the torque wrench now, ensure the seal is flush. Looks good from here. Looks good, nice penetration on that root pass. Yeah, very clean. <laughs> and with that thumbs up, the nose cone is officially secured to the upper stage. This precision is critical for mission success. This is where the magic happens. We're installing the flight control systems right here, which are essential for navigation stability during the mission. The precision here is unmatched. Our engineers are building the nervous system of the spacecraft ensuring every connection is absolutely perfect before integration. The trajectory is stable, but the final sequence is still running. Understood. And we have nominal systems. We're ensuring the surface is absolutely perfect before the next stage of the build process. As you can see, the booster integration is proceeding smoothly. All systems are currently nominal and we are green for final attachment. We just finished the main welding on this fuel tank segment. The precision here is absolutely critical for orbital flight. And Verify connection point seven, indicated here on the schematic. Confirmed. Preparing the torque wrench for final calibration. Graph is stabilizing right on target. Propulsion test successful. We're watching the team secure the main propellant line. Every connection is precisely torqued, ensuring flawless fuel delivery when the engines ignite. This is where the magic happens. Here we see the team meticulously torquing the main fuel connector using the new Sport S wrench. This is where the magic happens. The robots are currently welding the massive tank into place, a process requiring. Need is not like just applying age load inks to them pricing. This is for the to lower crane. And here and here connecting it all. The trajectory looks nominal, but we should cross-reference the atmospheric data. Agreed. The latest update should be visible on the main display now. We have a consistent reading here. Cross-referencing with the thermal data now looks good. All right, mark that as verified. We utilize the most advanced laser scanning technology right here on the factory floor. The precision of this robotic arm and meticulous work here in the assembly bay. We use this squeegee to ensure a perfect seal before carefully peeling back the transfer paper. We're utilizing the new inspection device to scan the entire surface area. 
It allows us to detect any imperfections long before final assembly. Check this rivet cluster right here. Looks slightly off nominal. Rerunning the diagnostic sequence. This is where we integrate the main components. The precision welding ensures structural integrity. And as you can see, the diag- The laser guides the final alignment before we initiate the fusion weld. Watch closely as the sequence begins now. All right, everyone, transitioning to launch phase. Ignition sequence start and lift off. As you can see, the trajectory is holding perfectly. Watch the thermal dynamics here as we increase the fuel flow. And there it is, full green across all parameters. Optimal performance achieved. The flow dynamics here, dynamics here are much smoother now. My telemetry confirms the pressure drop is stable across all five manifolds. As you can see, the thrust vectoring is stabilizing right at the critical juncture. We're seeing nominal pressure across all three engines now. Cinch the straps on the lower segment. Straps are secured, ready for transport. Slowly lowering the main payload. Copy that. Coming down steady. Watch the clearance on the starboard side. Looks good. Keep it coming. Hold it steady. Bring it down five inches. Copy that. Watching the clearance on the right. All right. Easy now. Easy. This is where the magic happens. We are looking at the main fuselage of the rocket. And as you can see, the team is applying the protective shroud right now. All teams confirm green status. We are proceeding with the tow. Confirmed. Moving slowly. Keep eyes on the pressure points. All right, team, we are ready for the cryogenic loading sequence. Thumbs up from here. All right, bring her down slow. Watch the alignment. Locked in. Yes. Great job, everyone. By utilizing these advanced robotic arms, we've revolutionized the manufacturing process. It is unmatched. We're aligning the final segment now. The hydraulic clamps engage right here. Alignment is stable, proceeding with the sequence. The cradle linkages look secure on this side. Confirmed on the schematic. We are clear to lower. Initiate the flow sequence now. Monitor the temperature gradient closely. We have significant venting. Fueling sequence nominal, pressure holding steady. Hose is clear, ready for ignition sequence. The telemetry on screen seven shows a slight pressure drop right here. The torque reading is slightly off nominal on this side. Diagnostics confirms the variance. Recalibrating. Preliminary reads complete. Copy that. We are green across the board. Confirmed. Launch. Go. Alignment on engine four is reading green. Verify torque on the starboard mount. Confirmed. All mounts secure. Ready for final telemetry check. We have terminal count. Green light confirmed on engine two. Copy that. Verifying telemetry now. Final lock sequence initiated. Clear the range. All stations report go for launch. Roger. Flight. We are go. T minus 10 seconds and counting. T minus 55 seconds and counting. Everything is looking good on the trajectory front. Copy that flight. The vehicle is ready. We are rapidly approaching the terminal count. The team is verifying the final alignment sequence now. We expect ignition right at the mark. We are incredibly proud of the Raptor engines you see here. The team is finalizing the connections, and look at that, a full- We've got a slight misalignment on engine three. Are the sensor readings stable on your end? Negative. I'm seeing a variance here as well. Let's recalibrate the laser. Ensuring all safety protocols are in place before the rockets launch. Trajectory holding steady on screen three. Copy that. Confirming engine parameters are nominal. We have full telemetry lock.
The burn is nominal, trajectory looks good. Confirmed acquisition of signal. Orbit achieved. Trajectory holding nominal. Altitude metrics look good. Copy that. Adjusting gimbal limits now. We are go for orbit insertion. Orbit confirmed. We have achieved orbit. Yes, congratulations, everyone.